I'm Margaret from Australia Yoga Guide. Have you ever heard the saying, you're as young as your spine? So, um, one of the things that I like to do to keep my spine nice and flexible is something called spinal cord breathing, which I learned from Qigong, but I often incorporate now into my Strala classes. Um, you can do it standing or sitting. In Qigong, we usually do it standing. So take your feet, just comfortably hit with the distance apart. Soften the knees, let your tailbone relax down. So it's more of an intention, just allowing your tailbone to uh, soften down as the crown of your head floats up to create some space in your spine. On your next inhale, inhale through the nose, float your arms up to go post arms, lift your chin and chest, your face up to the sky, and then round your back on the exhale, tucking your tailbone under, bringing your elbows together. Inhale to open, lift, expand, gentle arch in the back. Exhale to round in, tailbone tucks under, I'll turn towards you. Inhale through the nose to open and lift. Exhale, rounding in, so your mouth is closed, you're breathing through the nose, you're moving in time with your breath. Spinal cord breathing. Another nice thing to do to, to keep the flexibility in your spine is crawl on down to the floor. So this is a nice thing to do first thing in the morning. You can leave your yoga mat by your bed, crawl on down to the floor, come onto hands and knees, and we'll start with cat cow. So as you inhale, drop your belly down, let your sitting bones float up. Lift your chin and chest and up, and on the exhale, round your back like an angry cat. So it might feel nice to gently press the mat away with your palm. And with your breath, inhale, drop the belly, lift the chin and chest. On the exhale, round your back like an angry cat. So a few cat cows, and then just start to move your spine around any way that feels nice. Rolling and moving from your centre might feel nice to move your head as though you're drawing in the air with the tip of your nose but get your whole body involved send your bottom back to one heel feel that stretch in the side body and then send your bottom back to the other heel roll your torso around like your rib cage were a big washing machine change direction go the other way Moving slowly enough to get into all those tight spots. So, try that. It only takes a few minutes. And remember, it's not what you do for an hour once a week. It's what you incorporate into your daily routine. So whenever you have five minutes, move your body. Have a great day.